my God, it's amazing. Here, I'm going to talk in hiding. I'm acting as the Demandas Secretary. Somewhere here, hiding. It's not going to knock. Or did I? Please. Oh, I'm going to knock. A billionaire. He's here. Someone's hiding here. It's, it's Raghunath Das. Yes, behind the devotees, all devotees. Check him out. Check him out. Someone has to find Raghunath Das. Look behind Sri Prabhupada hiding. Very loud. Drag him out. <laughs> Das. Oh, Master, there, Raghunath Das. Thank you, thank you, my dear Srila Jayapataka Swami Maharaj. He is one of my eternal associates. I am Sri Nityananda Prabhu, and I am here in Pani Hati Dham with my dear most associates, like Abhiram Thakur, like Uddharan Thakur, like Parmeshwar, like Gadadhar Das, like Meena Ketana Ramdas, like Srila Jayapataka Swami Maharaj. There is a very special devotee here in the Pani Hati Dham, but he's hiding. But my dear secretary, Srila Jayapataka Swami Maharaj, has detected him. Raghunath Das, come here. You thief. You have been hiding. Look at his clothes. Look at his clothes. Look at the border of his kurta. <laughs> he comes from a very wealthy family. <laughs> Do you know the annual income of his father? Govardhan Vajum Haribo. Haribo. Rupai Gaur Haribo. Haribo. He tried to run away from home. And his what reply did you give? Tell all my devotees what reply you gave. Come here. <laughs> <laughs> Take this. I give you divine voice. So we have reached everyone. Dear devotees of Pani Hati Gram, I want to reveal my heart today. Dear Vaishnavas of Pani Hati Gram, no longer will I try on my own to go to Sri Goranga Mahaprabhu. I have come. To sell my life and soul, my heart, my existence at the lotus feet of Nityananda Ram and his wonderful eternal associates like Srila Jayapada Kumar. At this point, how will I know that I have received the mercy of Nityananda Ram? It is only when Nityananda Ram lovingly places his lotus feet on my head. <laughs> In the presence of so many Vaishnavas, if Nityananda Ram doesn't place his lotus feet on my head, how will I know that I have gotten his mercy? So do you all want me to be delivered? Do you want Nityananda Ram to place his lotus feet on my head? Listen to the transcendental words of my secretary. You have been given the danda. Yes. Danda. danda. Yes. You have been given the punishment. <laughs> Take the dust from the lotus feet of my secretary. <laughs> because the Lord of my life. Shri Shachinanda Gaurahari has said, Prabhu ka hai Vaishnav Seva Nama Sankirta. Prabhu ka hai Vaishnav Seva Nama Sankirta. Dui ka rajira babe.
The way to attain the lotus feet of Sri Shachinandan Gaurahari is to serve his devotees. And better than serving Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's devotees is to serve the devotees of the servant of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. You have to explain. I want all my devotees to understand why Raghunath Das was trying to run away from that towards which the whole world is running. Explain. O oh dear Nityananda Ram, by the mercy of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, I realized in my heart the shallow nature of this world. How much wealth can I enjoy after all? How much association of my wife can I enjoy after all? How fickle, how temporary, how impermanent are material sense objects. But the Lord of my life, Sri Gauranga Mahaprabhu is bestowing that which is beyond time and space. In this human form, which is temporary and full of miseries, Wise are those who give up sense objects and run for the ultimate well-being. Krishna Prema Prabhti. Prema Dhana Bina Daridra Jivan. Yartha Daridra Jivan. Without Krishna Prem, our life is poverty stricken. Oh Nityananda Ram, this is why I gave up everything that I had. Those who don't have it, they run towards it. And for all times to come, devotees, with raised arms, I proclaim, even if you have all of this, it's insignificant compared to the joy of serving Sri Gauranga Mahaprabhu and his eternal associates. This is why, this is why I gave up everything in an attempt to run to Jagannath Puri to be with my Lord, Sri Gauranga Mahaprabhu. I am Nityananda Ram. I am not different from Balaram. We like to enjoy our picnic on the banks of Yamuna. You are a wealthy young boy. You have come with so many servants and money. As your punishment, you have to observe the Chita Dahi festival. We are simple cowherd boys. Just give us some chipped rice. I'm not even asking you for rice. Just chipped rice, some yogurt and some fruits. You feed us and we'll be happy. And then I will bless you to attain the position of the servant of the servant of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. You will become Gaurangana Dasa. Sri Sarup Tamadur Goswami. You go to Sri Hilachal Dham, Jagannath Puri Dham, and there you will attain the lotus feet of Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. The most esoteric, intimate, deep Leela, the Ante Leela. You will be the first hand witness. You will be trained by Sri Swarup Damodar Goswami. I give you this benediction, but you must serve all my devotees by having the Chidadari festival. Can you do that? Yes, definitely, O Nityananda Ram. Please tell me, how should I do this? What are some things that I should have in these pots? First, you have to take the dust from the lotus feet of Sri Lajay Pataka Swami. <laughs> Lotus feet. Prabhura Agya. Hariba! Just by the touch of the dust of the lotus feet of the Lord. Oh, Shri Lajana Bala Hare Krishna. Yes. So how to make the Chidadahi? Only one person can tell you here. <laughs> this person was personally trained by my secretary Shila Jayapata Kaswani. There are only two people I am afraid of. At home I am afraid of my wife. And in the temple I am afraid of Mahatma Mataji. You have to ask how to make the festival to Mahatma Mataji. She will tell you how to make the chip rice. <laughs> What are some ingredients, Mataji? Please help me. 
<laughs> How can I observe this festival? Thank you. <laughs> I think he made me lose my voice. <laughs> I don't speak. Okay. Next one. I cannot explain in one word. So if you can relax, I will take a little time and I will give you explanation of these beautiful celebration today. Sure. So I beg you to peacefully take some time. Sure. And if you have to cry, that's also okay. <laughs>